Right then, Donna, you are in second place, so it's your choice now. You can play next, or you could ask Tony to play. I think Marcus is returning a favour for me, <laughs> stacking it up, so I would like to go next, please. I think that's wise. Yeah. 30 seconds, Donna, please. Your time starts now. In June 2020, which BBC soap opera temporarily stopped broadcasting new episodes for the first time in its 35-year history? Coronation Street. EastEnders. In which country of the UK is Butte House, an official office and residence of the First Minister? Pass. Scotland. The Mozambique Channel in the Indian Ocean separates which island nation from mainland Africa? Pass. Madagascar. In 2000, which Wall Street actor married Catherine Zeta-Jones? Michael Douglas. Michael Douglas, of course. Donna. Oh, Donna. I went blank. You did, yeah. literally. You've got nothing. Everything. Proper Wrong. blank. So no correct answers. The first answer, which BBC so... I know, I know. Corey. I've got ITV on my mind. Quite right, too. Yeah. I think we should give you a bonus count, just for saying that. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Donna, yeah. I'm so sorry. Your only hope is that Tony has an equal blank and doesn't get anything out of the machine. <laughs> uh, he's a little bit behind you, but you're staying oh. on 500 pounds. <laughs> okay. Right, Tony, here we go. 30 seconds for Tony, please. Your time starts now. In Aesop's collection of fables, which bird lays golden eggs? Eagle. Goose. In the US sitcom Friends, what relation is Monica to Ross? Boyfriend. Sister. In 1743, which King George became the last British monarch to personally lead troops into battle? Second. Correct. The Women's T20 World Cup is a tournament in the 20 overs form of which sport? Golf. Cricket. Huntsman cheese is made with layers of double Gloucester and which blue cheese? Blue Pass. cheese. Stilton. In 2008, a monument to the Beatles was built in the Zach Howley district. Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Tony, I'll give you this one. We're out of time. In 2008, a monument to the Beatles was built in the Zach Howley district of which German city? Did you know? Berlin. It was Hamburg. Yeah. One correct answer. You're doing your best to keep Donna in the game. I here, so I know. <laughs> uh, what you have done is you've got one chance to try and catch Donna. You need three counters to do just that. If you get three out, we'll force sudden death. If you get more than three, you're going through. Anything less, and you're going home, Tony, okay? Yeah. So what are you thinking? Drop zone one, please, Let's ben. do it. Drop zone one it is. Slams down, it's in the corner. Ooh, is that okay? Gonna get it at once, Marcus has left, I'm not sure. It's a couple on the edge here. We need three, Tony. Are they gonna go? Yes, they are! Oh, well done. Well done, Tony. Donna, that means yeah. we're gonna be losing you. You needed three, Tony. That's eight across the tipping points. A really good return from just the one counter. 400 pounds right there. Let's take it from the machine and put it into your bank. And that means we have come to the end of the round. Marcus is leading with 1,000 pounds. Tony goes through with 750 pounds. Donna, I'm afraid that means with 500 pounds we have found some points. Of course, you have won your picnic hamper, Donna. So yeah. it's not all bad. Thank you so much for playing. Thank you. It's been incredible. It's been lovely to meet. Thank you. So it is Marcus and Tony who will be going head to head after the break for the right to play for that 10,000 pound jackpot. Now for your chance for an amazing cash prize, just like our viewer Jackie. She won big by entering our competition, and you could too.